What's up guys, Corey Cedro here with Titan Lawn and Landscape. I just picked up an Echo CS271T handsaw. Uh, now, I'm a landscaper, I'm not a professional tree trimmer. We do low level tree trimming. I did pick up a bucket truck last year. Uh, I got it pretty cheap, it was a good deal, picked it up. So we do a lot of low level tree trimming. I'm not in a tree every day, uh, I'll go out and assist my crew going out on tree work if you know we have a tough spot to get into but basically what I was using was a Husqvarna 445 been a great saw for us for all these years we don't do a ton of tree work it does 90 percent of what we need to get done well when you're up in a bucket truck and you're throwing around a 12 to 14 pound chainsaw it gets really really tiring I did that all last year so I did a little bit of research and I came upon the Echo. I've heard good things about the Echo. I have an Echo pull saw. I've had it for 10 years. It's been fantastic. So anyways, uh, I've used that. So I picked up this Echo. I did some reviews. I picked it up on Amazon for right at 300 bucks. Uh, it's about a six pound saw. I haven't used it. So we're going to fire it up. This is my first use. I plan on using it mainly in the bucket truck when I'm in there. Um, and then just doing all this scrub stuff. I'm actually down in Table Rock right now, Table Rock Lake, down at the lake house for a few days before I head back to Des Moines and get the season kicked off, but I have some tree work I need to clear. I just want to give it a shot, so let's see how this thing goes. All right, so here's the saw. It's an Echo CS271T right there. I've never used this before. This will be the first time I used it. I've filled it up with oil and gas. I'm gonna fire it up. My first initial impression, it's really light. It's only six pounds. I know that they come. They came out with a uh, newer model. It's about a pound later. Uh, I haven't held that one or used it, but we're gonna try this one. So here's what I got. We got some brush in here at the house. All this scrub brush in here needs to go. These trees are growing up along the retaining wall cut a lot of this stuff out stuff that's hanging over take out that pine tree that's right up against that oak tree those from growing into each other start clearing some stuff out so guys this is the first time I've used this saw so we're just gonna have to see how it goes it's got good reviews but we'll see what happens
Alright guys, so you've seen me use it the first time. My first impressions, this is an awesome little saw. I wish I would have bought one five years ago. So I've been using a Husky 445 Rancher, just a basic saw. That saw has been an amazing saw for us. Had it for 10 years. We have beat the hell out of it and it just keeps on going. I love that saw, but it's a heavier saw. It's probably, I think it's a 14 or 15 pound saw. I bought this for doing little stuff like this. You could do this with the Rancher, but I bought this so you can so I can get up in the bucket truck, be up in a bucket truck all day and not get fatigued. This thing is so much lighter. You can operate it with one hand. Um, it's just a great little saw. So if this thing holds up to the abuse that the other Echo saw I have and my Husqvarna have held up to, it's going to be a fantastic saw. I mean, it'll outlive me uh, for sure. And I'm cutting through um, five inch diameter trees uh, like nothing. I mean, you guys just saw it. That's the first time I've ever used it. Literally put gas in it, put bar oil in it, and away we go. So, if you guys have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. Um, I'd love to answer them. Thanks for dropping by my channel, taking a look. Have a great day.